all right guys it's me again and in today's tutorial i'm gonna show you how you can patch your wi-fi with the better version of open core legacy patcher as we all know just a few days ago the developers at the open core legacy patcher released the sonoma early preview Open Core Legacy Patcher version 0.6.8. So, and you can see here it says with this release, the supported are uh, the graphics for Intel Ivy Bridge to Skylake, also the AMD GCN 1 to 3, which is the Polaris and the Vega. Also, for the guys with NVIDIA cards. The Kepler one, e.g., the GT710 680, you are also in luck. You can now patch your Sonoma to get full graphics acceleration on your NVIDIA card with this version of Open Core Legacy Patcher. So, also for us who uses the Broadcom wireless, also it's supporting that and all the modern Wi-Fi cards you can see them here also the legacy ones also have been included in this beta version so and if you come down here we see the model support the patch itself you can see the 2015 to 2017 MacBook SMBIOS 8,1 to 10,1 also the 2012 to 2017 MacBook Air Five comma and to seven comma. Also the Mac Mini six point to seven comma. Also the iMac two or nine and also. So in this video, I'm I'm not going to bother you a lot with a lot of stuff. So as you can see here, uh, also you can download the the open core legacy patcher here i'll leave a link in the description below where you can do that so 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 on this video it's going to be just patching up the wi-fi so i'll just go straight to it and you can see here it says enabling patching support for the modern Bro broadcom card so let's get started as you can see right here i don't have a wi-fi and my card is the BCM94360 which is the modern one and I know it's supported so let's go to the requirement first you need to download the KDK I'll leave also a link in the description below the KDK version that is the kernel debug kit 14.0 as you can see it's 17 hours ago the B sorry the build number is 23A5301G so you, I'll leave also this link in the description where you can download this one and also for this to work you'll need the Xcode 15 beta so you can download it from Apple website so let's continue guys with the patching of this so we need to open our EFI so let me just do that and for this let's just open our config.p list and let's continue here so we need to disable the SIP and we need to set this CSR active config to data and then add this number. So let's do that. Actually, I've already done that. So go to NVRAM and then here on the you need to add this. Also, the next thing you need to disable AMFI and you need to add this to your boot tag. Also, I've already done that. If you come to boot tags and if I go here 
this is the boot tag so up to there we are already good the next step you just need to go to secure boot and set it to disable so uh, open your config.p list go to miscellaneous and then security you need to disable your uh, secure boot model all right so the next thing we need to block the following text the i io skywalk family so i'll just continue with that so i'll just copy this one and next thing you need to go to the kernel on the block tab you need to add that one and then we need to set the mean kernel which is 23 so we just and then let me go open this so here it is let me just copy this one but this one is not add this to the comment and then on the st strategy just exclude and then enable so after that let's save our config.p list and then we need to have this two cakes the io skywalk cakes and the io 82 one one family legacy cakes so if you don't know where you can get this one you need to go to the you need to go to the open core legacy patcher and then to the payloads come here to cakes and then wi-fi so you'll see this one is the but this one is the on the main branch so if you go to sonoma branch you can see the cakes right here the just download this one let me just download it and also the skywalk family.zip also let me just download it so that's done the next thing we need to do sorry let me just go back here to the tutorial it's the Sonoma branch and let's go to the commit let's go down to okay here it is so we need to add this text to our efi folder so i'll just do that so go to the download extract the the text let me go take it to my desktop and also the second one also to the desktop and I'll need to open my EFI and then open the cakes folder after that I need to add those cakes to my EFI so the next thing guys you need to come here to the kernel tab and then you add our Let me add our cakes with the new cakes and so the next thing here it says that we have these cakes as a child which is the airport bcrm nick cakes so what we need to do we need to ensure that is injected and set the main kernel to 23.00 
so just copy this one and then let's go here and this is it and then come here to mean kernel and paste that one right there also the f here we need to this io skywalk to be on the top of all this so that it it should be in this manner which is io skywalk and then family legacy and then the the nick so after i've just done that what you need to do is just save so that one is done so the next thing we need to open our downloaded open call legacy patcher so this is it just open it and then click on post install so as you can see i say the available patches for my system is the networking modern wireless so i'll just start the root patch and go to yes key in your password and let's wait for it to do its magic okay let's wait for it background background item has been added and now it's, rebu it's rebuilding the kernel cache this may take some time so let's wait for it to okay so there we go it says the patch has finished successfully so we need to reboot so i'll just reboot it and come back when the machine is up so we can see if it, the wi-fi will work or not so okay folks as you can see after the restart you can see we have the wi-fi here it's working and if we go to the settings we can see the available wi-fi you can turn it on you can turn it off so that's it guys you can see it's connected and for example let me just open the web browser let's go to google.com so that you can see So as you can see here the internet is working the wi-fi also the bluetooth is working and this is the mac os sonoma there we go so guys that's it that is for this video and that's how you can install the beta version of the open core legacy patch version 0.6.8 so that's it guys until next time feel free to subscribe share